द टर्मिनेटर ऑल्सो नोन एज द ग्रे लाइन एंड ऑल्सो रिफर टू एज द टॉयलेट जोन हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू टॉप ब्रेन जी के टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न अबाउट वॉट इज टर्मिनेटर टर्मिनेटर इज द मूविंग लाइन डेट सेपरेट्स डे एंड नाइट ऑन अर्थ और एनी अदर प्लानिटरी ग्लोब In simple words, we can say that the line that separates day and night is called the terminator. This terminator line passes through most location on Earth twice a day, once for sunrise and the second time for sunset. The location of the terminator depends on the axial tilt of the Earth. so the terminator never crosses the pole during polar day and polar night because both poles experience long time darkness in winter months and long time sunlight in the summer months it is a common thought that when half of the earth is covered in darkness the other half is covered in sunlight but it is actually not true because of the bending of the sunlight the land covered by sunlight having greater area than the land covered by darkness because the earth's atmosphere bends sunlight by half a degree which is about 37 miles why does the earth have a terminator line the terminator line is a result of the earth rotation and its position from the sun as we know our earth rotates on an imaginary line which is known as axis which runs from north pole to south pole and it takes approximately 24 hours for the earth to complete a full one rotation during this rotation different parts of the earth experience daylight and night time how the earth's terminator changes with the seasons the shape of the terminator curve changes with the seasons when you compare terminator curve on equinox and other on solstices there is a huge difference during the equinox the sun can be observed directly over the equator it means on equinox day and night are approximately in the same length because at equinox there is no tilt of the earth with respect to the sun so the terminator line is parallel to the axis of the earth in other side the solstice occurs when the earth's axis tilts most toward or away from the sun when the earth is tilted away from the sun the sun appears south of the equator and when the earth is tilted toward the sun the sun appears north of the equator during solstice the terminator line is at its greatest angle with respect to the axis of the earth i hope i explained to all of you what is terminator line and how it happens thank you so much for watching this video if you have any query do let me know in my comment box thank you